everyone i hope everyone is doing well today I came up with another video on mostip on campus placement in this video we are going to discussing about embedded software engineer role and analog and digital design engineer role okay embedded software engineer role for csc students or triple e ec students are also eligible whereas analog and digital triple e and ec students are eligible before going into the video if you are new to the channel please do subscribe share and like my videos if already a subscriber please hit a like so that it motivates me to do more and more videos for you consider subscribing to my channel because it is the ratio between subscribed and not subscribed people if you feel these videos are worthy hit a like and subscribe to my channel without any delay let us see the eligibility cgpa should be more than 70 percentage and the lpa coming to the lpa for analog students 6 to 7 lpa uh, for analog students and 4 to 6 lpa for digital and embedded students and six months of training after shortlisting okay if you are eligible if you have got shortlisted in uh, this um, most on campus placement then they will provide six months of internship in internship they might provide 25,000 or less than 25,000 as a stipend okay and during training they will provide the stipend also I hope you got clear idea with the eligibility and packages let us see the pattern for both the roles pattern for both the roles analog and digital and embedded systems have both of them has this type of pattern only round one prelims means online exam in your uh, college itself you will write the exam coming to the round two the one who qualified in round one they're eligible for the round two and in round two um, you have to visit another college not your college and their college if they they might be some other colleges they will give as a center and you have to write your exam over there and this exam is called mains offer an exam they will give a college center for exam and round three is a technical interview followed by hr interview right let us see the separate separate roles analog and digital design engineer role means round one they will provide 50 mcq questions online exam one hour on circuit circuit networks and electronic devices and the circuits and cmos circuit logic and digital design and aptitude okay on these topics they will uh, arrange the round one and it is total mcqs only online exam for one hour and coming to the embedded software engineer role round one 50 multiple choice questions online exam one hour and coming to the topics c language microprocessor and controllers and aptitude in these uh, topics they will focus mainly right i hope you got clear idea with the analog digital uh, uh, design engineer role round one as well as embedded software engineer role also coming to the round two this is a subject to exam offline and you need to focus on circuit networks and electronic devices and circuit and cmos circuit logic and digital design actually for analog and digital role they will provide two question papers first analog question paper they will provide and one uh, one and a half hour they will provide and you can write your exam and then digital paper they will provide and you have to write the exam based on your performance in analog and digital they will segregate the students whether they belongs to analog role or digital role okay analog for 50 marks and digital for 50 marks based on your performance in analog and digital roles only you will be uh, interviewed okay on that topic you will be interviewed and they will assign that roles in your job okay i hope you got clear idea they will give two papers analog separate paper digital separate paper you have to write based on your performance only you will get interviewed and your role will be selected okay and it is an offline exam you have to go to the center and based on your performance i have already told you your is your roles are decided and round three is technical round followed by the hr round embedded software engineer role round two means subject to offline exam two hours 120 marks okay it is for 120 marks uh, c language for 40 marks okay 40 marks microprocessor and controllers also 40 marks aptitude 40 marks okay and total 120 marks and you should uh, be shortlisted in order 
to attend for technical interview round 3 is technical interview followed by hr interview right i hope you got clear idea with the pattern if you feel this video is worthy please hit a like subscribe to my channel share with your friends thank you so much for your support thank you